welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a cookie dough dessert. A banana mousse, banana cream and then the cookie dough and some cream on top. Let's get started. This one is a little bit similar to the cookie dough ice cream that I did, but that one was following someone else's recipe and today we're doing mine. First of all, we want to cook our flour because it needs to be cooked so we can eat it. I'm using some gluten-free flour. You can use any other type of flour. So now we're gonna cook this for 10 to 15 minutes, 180. Next step, two tablespoons of butter. I'm using soy butter. And now we're gonna melt it in the microwave for 30 seconds. That's how it looks. Next, two teaspoons of peanut butter. And two teaspoons of brown sugar. Also, my butter is salted butter. That's important too. Now we're gonna wait with this until the flour is ready. And we're gonna go for the banana. So we're gonna be using this Oatly cream. It's whippable and it has vanilla flavor and it's amazing. If you don't have any cream that's whippable and it's dairy free, you can just use any other cream that it's dairy free. It doesn't need to be whippable. Now the banana. You can use frozen bananas if you have them too. It's so two bananas. Now we're gonna add some of our, look at this. It's oat cream. Just amazing. It's just enough to mix it. Mm. This is usually gonna be super sweet. If you want it more sweet, you can also add some of these. And now our flour is already done. So we're gonna start mixing in the flour. Yeah, I think I burned the flour a little bit and it's quite dark. It tastes amazing. And now when it's getting dry, we're gonna add a tiny bit of dairy cream milk. Don't worry if the cookie dough is not super sweet because we're gonna mix it with the banana and the banana is already super sweet. So if this is a little bit salty, that's good. I'm gonna cut some chocolate as chocolate chunks for the cookie dough and also to decorate. I left the cookie dough in the fridge because it was super hot and I couldn't mix the chocolate now because it would melt. So keep that in mind. So we have everything ready. I'm gonna add the chocolate chunks to our cookie dough. So first the banana. Now we're gonna add the cookie dough. You can make cookie dough balls if you want. I think it's not necessary, so I'm just gonna put it in chunks like this. And if you don't have white cream, you just leave them like this. But if you can, we're gonna add our cream on top. And now some chocolate. Leave them in the fridge or eat them right away. And they are amazing. It's amazing. It literally takes 20 minutes to make them and they are delicious. That's it for today's video. You should really try them out because they are super easy to do. It's super fast and really, you need to try them. And with that said, thanks for watching today's video. I hope you like it. Subscribe if you want to see more and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. See you in the next one. Photos before this melts. Okay, we need to move the TV. Okay, on it. Because that's the only spot where we can take our cute photos. <laughs> Any ideas for something else?